Hey friends, this is Pastor Gabe. I don't know if you've heard the news, but the ban on large gatherings that was in effect in the state of Kansas has been lifted. So now we can gather together for church on Easter Sunday and it won't be illegal. (laughs) We've still been meeting for church every Sunday anyway, but we've been a small group and really spread out in the sanctuary. And we still want to practice those guidelines that have been put in effect in the midst of this pandemic. If for whatever reason we start to get a lot of people in the sanctuary and things start to get a little close, well, we've got another room that we can put people in where the service will be shown on the TV in in that room. Just know that if you come to church on Sunday for an Easter service, we will be there and I will be preaching and we would like to have you. Let's be smart about this, though. If you don't feel good, don't come to church. If you think that you might be uh, at risk of something, maybe you have some pre-existing conditions, then please play it safe. As with previous Sundays, I'm going to have some kind of a message online that I will have recorded the night before. So uh, that video will be posted on the church Facebook page and on the church website, go to jcbaptist.net or on Facebook, you are looking for First Southern Baptist Church of Junction City. Now, as part of the precautions, we are not going to have a time of greeting. There won't be Sunday school, there won't be child care, and we won't be passing the offering plate. But I think it will be wonderful to get together and celebrate the resurrection of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, with some great singing and hearing the resurrection story is preached from the word of God. Now, we celebrate the resurrection of Christ every Sunday that we gather. It's why the church meets on Sunday. That's the Lord's day. That's the day of the week that Jesus rose from the dead. And so every time we get together, we are celebrating that death has been conquered through the blood of Christ that was shed on the cross for our sins. We are forgiven. And by faith in Jesus, we stand before God as justified. Even death itself self has been conquered for us so that though our body may die, we will live forever with God in glory. If you have faith in Jesus, if you want to know more about this and you live here in the Junction City area, then please come and uh, and visit us on Sunday. And would love to share with you more about the gospel of Christ. If you're practicing some social distancing, I get that. You can always email me, send an email to, well, I'll put the uh, the email address right here at the bottom of the page. And uh, and I'll even add you to a list and keep you updated on some of the things that we have been doing in the midst of this pandemic. Thank you so much for your prayers and your kind and considerate support of our ministry, even through this tough time. And we still want to be kind and considerate of one another, looking out for our neighbors in the midst of a pandemic. The disease is not over. The sickness is still out there. So be smart and be safe, but trust in the Lord with all your heart for even though Modern medicine is a wonderful marvel and can uh, sustain you longer and help you live a little bit longer than you might otherwise. It cannot save your soul. Our only salvation is in Christ alone. God bless. Happy Easter.